Welcome to Electro Online. Now let's take a closer look at the word definition. What is a definition? A definition is something that defines something and of course when you don't know what the word definition means you will not know what the word define means because that's in essence what a definition is. But better yet you can use the word explains. A definition explains the meaning of a mathematical term. That's what we mean by defining something. It simply explains it. In plain English, it tells you what it is. That's what we mean by a definition. Some examples of that, here first we have an angle. What is the definition of an angle? It is the inclination of one line to another at the point where they meet. Inclination means slope. In other words, if we take one line here, and then we have another line of a different slope, and where they meet, the inclination forms an angle. There's the angle. That's how we define it. The vertex is the point where two lines meet. Here we have two lines. They meet at a point. So this here is called the vertex. That's simply by definition. We don't need to prove it. That's just the way it is. An acute angle is an angle of less than 90 degrees. Here we have an example where the angle is less than 90 degrees. That would then be, by definition, called an acute angle. We don't need to prove it. It simply is by definition. And finally, a square. Of course, we have many, many more things that are defined, but here are simply four examples. And here we have a square, which is a quadrilateral. Now, quadrilateral, quad means four, and lateral means side. So quadrilateral is something that has four sides, which that's how you define a square. But with a square, all sides are equal and all angles are equal. And that's simply by definition. We don't need to try to prove that. We define a square as a quadrilateral where all sides are equal and all angles are equal and we don't need to prove it. That's what we mean by definitions and there's many such definitions that can help us prove other things like theorems because we know that these are true. They're simply defined as such. And that's what we mean by definition.